Hello church, welcome to New Life. As you can see, we've taken it outside. The weather is absolutely brilliant. And to build upon that brilliance, we're going to give you some brilliant news to make a note of. So, take your pens, your papers, and let's hit it with some great, fabulous New Life news. The word says that all believers should be baptised. So if you're not baptised at the moment, it'll be a great opportunity to do so. And it'll be a great opportunity on the 12th of October at New Life Derby at 6pm. But two weeks before that, there'll be a training happening again at New Life Derby at 7pm. Now, if you want further information, please come to the Resource Centre or please speak to the General Office. So our mission prayer focus for the month of September is the Masai Mandi Orphanage in India. The missions team will be visiting India in November, so please keep them in your prayers. And we need to ensure that we can pray for the young people who are living below the poverty totem line in India. And to build upon that, we have our monthly mission prayer event. And that will be happening on the 27th of September, that's a Saturday, starting from 4pm and finishing at 6pm. There will be refreshments, but there's a long list of things that we need to pray for. for those, so those two hours are going to flash by. So, It'll be great to see you there. Operation Christmas Child starts today. Yes, I said today. And this is the world's largest children's Christmas project occurring. And there's two ways that you can help out. There's one, donating, or two, by keeping, filling, and wrapping an empty shoebox. Now, the deadline for doing so and returning that to the church is going to be the 26th of October. So. Come on, let's work together, collect these shoe boxes and fill them up with great gifts to give away. So one of our most popular courses here at New Life is going to be starting again. It's the Grace course. It's going to be offered from the 1st of October, the 6th of November, and it happens every Wednesday evening from quarter past seven in the evening to quarter to ten. Please visit our resource centre and get more information and also ensure that you sign up. I rock em like you rock em. <laughs> So men's breakfast is back in the month of October and that will be happening from the 4th from 9am to 11am and our guest speaker will be Paul Hunt. Now for all of you who will be peckish and I know each and every one of you will be, please bring along £4 to the Resource Centre because that will give you the opportunity to have that bacon, that egg, that toast and etc etc. So please come along and one key note to also remember is there's going to be a 25% discount. So if you bring a friend along, rather than paying £4, both of you will only be paying £6. So we look forward to seeing you then. So to all the 18 and 30 somethings in church, even if you're in your 40s and you're young at heart, please listen up. This month's step out mission is going to be bowling. So everyone who's interested in bowling, please ensure that you send your name and details to the email on the screen or just visit us at Resource Centre and leave your name and number and we'll ensure we give you more information and we can have some fun. It's going to be a time for us to relax, chill, speak to each other, get to know what we do, and fellowship and praise God in a different kind of way. Positive Youth will be holding a three-day special experience called the Slum Survivor from the 24th to the 26th of October. Now, for each and every one of you in Positive Youth, what you'll be experiencing is living just like billions of people around the world live. So the chosen charity for that month is Open Doors, which is a charity in Zimbabwe. And basically they look after kids aged between four to six. So if you need to sponsor or have prayer specifically for that mission, please speak to anyone in the youth team or please include them in your prayers on a daily basis. As we all know, every month we come together at the end of the month to pray for our nation, for our city, for our families and for everyone that we care for. So our Friday night prayer is going to be on the 26th of September. The prayer starts at 9pm to 11.30. Please ensure you come together and pray for the nation. Let's pray for everything that we always wanted and lift the house of God in prayer and ensure that we can be blessed with everything that God has promised us. So every once in a while we always have a special time when we come together, bring the house of God together and worship one God, one Alpha and Omega, our Lord Jesus Christ. And as you know, this is a great session to come along. We've had some in the past and this is going to be one with a difference. 
There's going to be four sessions and they're going to be starting on a Friday the 17th at New Life Derby, going on to the 18th of, on Saturday. Now, the key timings will be from 7 to 10 on a Friday, 9 to 12 on a Saturday, 2 to 5 on a Saturday again, and once more from a 7 to 10. So, come along and let's dwell as one church, one community. So here at New Life, we're quite privileged because we've got our own dedicated prayer team. So our next prayer for healing is going to be on the 22nd of September from 7.30 till 9, and that's tomorrow. Please use the Home Street entrance, but you can also get inf more information by speaking to Kathy Asher. This is going to be a time where you can get some spiritual, emotional, or physical prayer and ensure that God can answer those very inner thoughts and wishes that we have. See you there. So thank you for listening to the New Life News. I know it was a long list of items that we went through, but if there's any questions or you'd like to find out more information, please refer to your New Life Times. Please also make sure you visit the Resource Centre and get more information on any specific events or items that you want to carry forward. Also join us in the living room for some teas and coffees and we'll see you there.